This is a Stormwatch special report. Good afternoon, everyone. Here's our picture right now. Looking out over New York City, you can see the ceiling has lowered. Those clouds are dropping down uh, in anticipation of the storm coming to the area. 72 right now. And we have had some rain in the area. Here's your picture. Uh, it's sort of spotty throughout the area right now. The real show that we're watching is right here. The remnants of Ida, okay, I think it's being referred to now as a post-tropical cyclone Ida. This is where the worst is for us. And I'm thinking our time frame will be about for the worst activity, about 5 p.m. to maybe 5 a.m., somewhere in that window. Right now, you still have activity out there. You can see we've actually got, zoom in right, right there into northeastern Westchester County, right around Somers. There's a pretty good thunderstorm there. Ridgefield, Connecticut, you're dealing with it. Danbury as well, getting ready to move towards Mayo Pack. And again, this is not the big event. The big event has not gotten here yet. But I, and I want to talk about this because right now, you see a big swath of nothing, right, of dry air and not catching the rain for a good chunk of New Jersey. Well, this storm is not moving due north. It's moving to the northeast. So this is all going to be tracking over the area. So how does it break down? We think the bigger rainfall totals will be most likely north and west of New York City. But some of the biggest volatility, I think, is going to be south of New York City. It makes perfectly good sense to me. Look at this. The tornado watch has been expanded a bit. And why would we be focusing on this area? Well, if our center circulation is basically, and this is it, it's kind of stretched out right now, this is the center right here. All right? So if that's the center of your circulation, moving this direction, it's that right hand northern quadrant. It's right here that you get the worst activity. So, sure enough, it's that area that we have a tornado watch until 10 p.m. It has been expanded now to include the coastal areas in Monmouth and Ocean counties as well. Uh, it could get real tricky out there. Look at this. You get into Monmouth and Ocean County, a little bit into Middlesex County as well. It's a 10% risk for tornadoes today. Okay, I've been with you for 15 years doing this here in, in New York City. That's the highest number that I've ever seen for this portion of New Jersey. I mean, even a 5% chance through New York City. I mean, yes, we've seen that before, but it, rare, rarely, and then a 2% for some areas north. So that's where I want us to be really cautious today. It's not a hurricane. It's not a tropical storm. I'm telling you, this is going to bring less rain than we had with Henri, but a lot of rain, but it's going to bring more wind and certainly more of that possibility with some twist in the atmosphere. I'll have more on all this, guys. But again, keep it tuned right here. I'll walk you through everything. The biggest stuff has not gotten here yet. I think about 5 p.m. until 5 a.m will be the worst for us. More coming up. Let's get you back to your shows. Here you go. This has been a Stormwatch special report.